Hey, for absolutely no reason whatsoever, I have a piece of graphite in a vacuum chamber, 30 volt power supply, 12 volt power supply. We're gonna suck all the air out of this thing, and then we're gonna put 30 volts across that. And see how long it takes. Oh, there it goes. I didn't expect that to last too long anyway. Let's see. Well, there's a lot of smoke. And the graphite completely burned up and melted part of my cook lead. That was successful. Let's try it again. So we have another piece in there. and Let's turn the vacuum on. Give it a minute to suck all the air out. Make sure I have the flow valve in the right direction. Attach power. And then see what happens. It's drawing 5 amps. I don't know why it's not burning up. Let's kill the vacuum. Wires aren't getting hot. Do not burn off in a vacuum. Okay. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to find a way to hold my phone up so we can pull this out of vacuum on camera. I'm going to keep drawing a vacuum that way you don't miss anything. Oh, starting to smoke. Turn the power supply off. Turn it back on. Okay. Interesting. Hmm. Hmm. Don't know why I can't get it to light back up. Let's try pulling a vacuum on it. It's definitely smoking. Yeah, there's not a good connection on it, that's why. Everything up here is hot. Oh, right, I would if I applied power. Hmm. Let's try another piece of lead. Ooh. And lead broke. I should probably mention that this is graphite and not lead. And if you do have lead, do not do this with lead. Just don't play with lead in general. Okay. Power supply is going to go on. Oop.
Let's see if we can get this to light up as far as it did earlier. I'm gonna turn power off while we draw a vacuum. It's gonna burn up. Put the vacuum off and see what happens at normal pressure. Oh, okay, it's getting bright, so let's put it under the vacuum before it breaks. There it goes. We did it. So, thank you guys for watching, and see you next time.